This method allows the visualization of zebrafish brain in later larval stages to allow the observation of the neuronal architecture in a high detailed fashion in vivo that has previously not been possible. Pigment cells which emerge during later larval development and prevent the brain from clear imaging are no problem with this method because they are simply removed. With this method, it should be possible to study processes that occur at later stages during larval development of the brain. Processes that impact on synaptic plasticity, degeneration of neurons or their regeneration. Before beginning the experiment, use a micropipette puller to prepare sharp, thin glass needles from glass capillaries. Next, use a plastic Pasteur pipette to collect larvae into a 90 mm diameter petri dish containing the appropriate solution. Transfer the selected larva to a 35 mm diameter petri dish containing ACSF and place a 24 by 24 mm square glass cover slip into the petri dish lid. Then aliquot the volume of ACSF needed for the experiment into an appropriate vial for oxygenation with carbogen. To embed the larva, use a Pasteur pipette to transfer the anesthetized larva to a mounting chamber under a stereo microscope. If any larva are still able to move, do not use the fish for the experiment until the fish are completely unable to move. When the larvae are immobile, carefully remove